everybody and welcome back to Homestead. You know how I thought spring was around the corner? It wasn't. It's winter now. <laughs> Whoops. So yeah, we have a lot we have to do today. I want to get so, so much done. So, um, in the last episode, we brought home two horses. Yes, two. And uh, also, one of the things I want to do, I want to go to the nether at some point and I want to get another rack for right there. So that way we can have like a working fireplace. <clears throat> oh my goodness, sorry, my throat is still, if you watched any of my videos from uh, last week, you would know my throat is not the best. Um, I've been having some laryngitis issues due to like allergies and like over talking and yeah, so you now if I clear my throat a few times and sound really annoying, I apologize. But <clears throat> again, I am sorry. Um, <laughs> so I, was, uh, ooh, we have like a little ice path all the way over here. This is fantastic. Oh, just missed it. Alrighty, that hopefully will do it. My throat is, uh, not fantastic today, but I was working. Um, I already showed you guys the barn. I really want to get going on this barn because you'll see why in a moment. Oh, it is very distressing. Okay, um, but I did go ahead and I got more dirt blocks and I uh, expanded on the pastures. So as you can see, I, I was I had to clear a whole bunch of trees and whatnot. So um, all that stuff is in there. I've been slowly moving it back over to the house, but there were a lot of trees in this area, as you can see, because I mean, look at all the trees around it. And then I cleared all of this of trees. So all of this eventually is going to be fenced in. It is all going to be pasture. This is going to be a barn that our, our prized top horses will be in the stalls. And then we can come over here in the mornings and uh, let them out for turnout and then bring them inside at the end of the day. Um, and then this is gonna be like a little, like um, it's gonna be open. I think I'm gonna have some arches and whatnot. and. Um, going to put like the the troughs and stuff for the cows in there why is there a bone just floating interesting anyway moving on okay so that's kind of what I want to do for that but um yeah that's good that's gonna take a little bit of work oh we missed it okay get up not under the ice on the ice there we go um unfortunately all the little fishies in the river are dying because they are um they're dying they get trapped under the ice and I don't know what's going on I don't think it should be an issue, but as you can see, they get trapped under the ice and they die. Unfortunate. What uh, has happened and why we need to really get a move on on this barn is that our two horses, remember how you saw the one horse, and, uh, or I mean, well, I gave them both wheat, right? And then, um, and then the one, or both of them, sorry, had love hearts. And I was like, no, don't make a baby. And they didn't make a baby. Well, it was pregnant. The horse was pregnant and she gave birth and she has given birth many, many, many times over and sheep, sheep. Jesus. This is why we need to get, uh, separate our animals because we are getting another overpopulation issue again. Excuse me, everybody. So yeah, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven horses you guys seven horses oh no sorry we have eight one has escaped that's fine be free do your horse thing um actually i think some of these uh i'm actually just gonna i'm just gonna set them loose like you you wait i didn't i didn't want to get on you no 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 no. your steed will wait for you what that's interesting can i pick the horse can you stop please okay no we, uh, we cannot, that is interesting. Our steed will wait for us. That's really cool. So does that mean they actually will like stand there and wait for us? Because if that is the case, that is amazing. Um, but as you can see, some of the sheep have gotten out. Some of the horses have gotten out. Some of the chickens have gotten out. It is just chaos, chaos, pure chaos. Oh no, please, please, everybody stop. Ow, ow, no. Ugh. We need to move the horses, you guys. We need to move them tomorrow. Or, yeah, tomorrow. Or wait, no. We needed to move them yesterday. That's what I was trying to say. I'm sorry. My, <laughs> not only is my throat all scratchy and I'm just jumbled. I'm just a, I'm just a jumbled fool today. So what I want to do today is I want to start working on the barn, I think. Um, I mean, I'm pretty sure I want to start working on the barn. I just don't know the kind of, the style for the barn. You know what I mean? 
So, um, and I don't think I'm going to be making it out of cordwood, honestly, because that is just ridiculous. I mean, yeah, the amount of cordwood needed would be unimaginable, astronomical. Ooh, look, fishies. Um, we'll just, we'll just pick those up. Uh, yeah, okay, we got three fishies on us now. So I think what I want to do is I want to come over here and I want to grab, I think, some mm -hmm, sp spruce. Yeah, and maybe some, where's all our oak wood? I know we had more oak wood. Oh wait, maybe, maybe our oak wood's over in the chest. Did I put the oak wood over in the chest? I honestly don't know. Also, really quick before we go, see this uh, this bay mare behind us here. She is the original one that we found, and Kellen dude left a comment on. I hope I'm pronouncing your name right. Um, left a comment on our last homestead video and suggested the name of Cinnamon for her. So I went ahead and I named her Cinnamon. I thought it was just the most adorable name for a horse of her color. I was just like, you know what? That is. That is cute, I love the name. And so her name shall now be Cinnamon for now until the end of time. Okay, um, I'm so sorry fishies. Um, let's work our way over this direction. I'm sheep, sheep, why? Um, I'm fairly confident that I put the oak wood and whatnot over in this chest while I was cutting trees. I did, I did, excellent. Um, there we go, we, actually we have, we have we have tons of oak wood. Wow. Okay. Actually, I'm gonna leave the sword there. We're gonna have the axe, then the spruce, and the spruce. And we can just put, put that, put this all over here. Get out of the way. Uh, oak wood and spruce wood. There we go, you guys. Um, and so also in between episodes, I've just kind of been. Uh, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Back there. Okay. You can see the little green, little green dots back there. Um, yeah. Um, not, not me. Back over there, behind my shoulder, yeah. Um, <laughs> I have been growing our hemp um, from these seeds that we have gotten from just kind of like breaking blocks and whatnot. So yeah, um, the hemp is growing. It is taking a really, 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 really long time to grow. But I think uh, once it is fully grown, um, then we can actually start making our windmill for, for up there. But I think we should just kind of get going on this. I don't honestly know what I want to do to do with it to be to be perfectly honest I might just kind of like do this so that they can't get out and then segregate the uh, the stallions or the male horses over here because I can't be having all these baby horses you guys it's just it's just I can't I can't there's just so many of them um, it is actually getting overwhelming the number of horses that we have I, I mean at one point I was like should I just like kill some of them but I'm like no because it's not like I would eat them or anything I mean you know but they've been do they're domestic they've been raised in hi sheep skis yeah did you have to do that no did you yes I also forgot my 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 saw back at the house so I think um, I'll probably uh, just maybe what I'll do is I'll leave that gap and then I can just put them in here, but I feel, I, no, I mean, they're living outside right now. So really what's, what's the harm? I think I am going to go and grab my, I only have two leads and we missed it. And now we're stuck under, the, no, no, I don't die like this. Okay, good. <laughs> we live. I'm going to go grab my two leads and we're going to slowly, I think, well, we can ride one and then lead over. Uh, two more so we can bring them through over three at a time. Hopefully we won't have to make too many trips, but you know famous last words right there Goodness gracious you guys I am done um, I finished up and then I came upstairs and I slept because it was pretty late at night and um, Yeah, things were things were starting to go horribly horribly wrong, but we did I think I'm gonna go out and I'm going to make 100% sure that there are no uh, that there are no stallions left in the mare's pasture because I did make the mistake of moving one of the mares over to the stallion's pasture and then I saw love hearts so now I'm convinced one of them is going to give birth I seriously hope not so you're definitely a mare okay good and you no that's not what I want you are no 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 um Oh my gosh, you've, you've got, seriously, right now, why is this happening? Why is it only you? I don't know. 
Um, let's try cinnamon here. Yeah, see cinnamon. I but I know cinnamon's a mare. Um, it, and then you, and then and then you. Okay, this is this is strange. I don't know why this is happening. But some of them, it doesn't let me see their info. I don't really know. Maybe if I, I hop on them and then we open... Okay, yeah, this one's a mayor. Okay, so I just have to hop on a few of them just to see. Okay, we are running low on the wheat. We need... We need... Um, we need winter to wrap up so that that way we can start producing more wheat because the water does freeze over and then we are unable to grow anything... Um, yeah, the the yeah, it's just it's a it's a little annoying. But that's kind of how it is in in real life in in winter, you know. There, no, stop. Stop. No, just put let me put the food in the bin. Ugh. Hi. Yes. Yeah, fine. Okay, you get some wheat. You get some wheat. Uh you get the wheat. You get the wheat. Everybody gets the wheat. Okay, and then sheep eat out of your little Stop it. Stop it right now. Oh my goodness. These animals, you guys. But now it is time to go check on the hemp. Holy moly. Um, ooh, some of the hemp has grown. But yeah, you see what I mean? Like the ice, it just freezes over. And um, and then the this was all plowed earth, like cropland. And then look at, this is dry. So things grow considerably slower around here in the winter. That's all right. Ooh, we got some hemp seeds from that. We got some more hemp. Perfect, perfect. Um, I think maybe, yeah, we can get something from that one, but then that's it. So, allow me to show you what we need to do with the hemp. Alrighty, so once you have grown the hemp, uh, this is part of the whole Better With Mods, Better With Mods mod. <laughs> that's a, kind of a tongue twister there, for me at least. Um, it, 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 that's the mod that kind of lets you do the whole windmill thing. Um, but you have to have this millstone and you put the hemp into the millstone or the, the hand crank thingy or the mill. This is the millstone and this is the hand crank. So you just right click the hand crank as you do and you sit here and you mill the hemp, you know, into hemp fibers. Basically, you're grinding it up um, the, the, the plant fight, the plant and then into the fiber. So, oh, look at, look at, there's some, there's some right there. Um, and then once you have, once spring comes along, I'm going to plant, I think, more seeds uh, so that way we can get uh, that way we can get hemp a little faster oh my goodness my words are just oh uh, i'm too ex I'm, okay apparently i'm too hungry i'm too tired or exhausted or whatever to make the hemp must eat must eat must eat my black raspberries and that's another thing we need to plant those black raspberry bushes that i brought back from the village because those uh give you pretty good pretty good health you guys so let's just sit here i'll crank away on these hemp fibers it has four more to go and then i'll catch up with you guys Alrighty, it is the next morning and i've run out of food i run out of energy so that means didn't mean to do that there we go uh, that means we need to run back to the house Hopefully not die from any of the mobs that spawned last night. I actually didn't see... See, that's the thing. We cannot move. We can Literally, if something decided it wanted to end us right now, there is nothing we could do. But thankfully, we have made it safely back to our house. Hi, Rue. How's it going? We are very, very hungry. Um, let's take, I think, like half of our chicken and just pop it in the... Um, what is it? The... But is it like the cooking for blockheads mod? Look at this, you guys. This is amazing. It just turns it from uh, raw chicken into cooked chicken nine at a time. How fantastic is that? And look, look at our, I, I can see our horse over there like, hey, <laughs> what about me? Um, sorry, buddy. You, you had too many babies and now you're kind of in a bit of a timeout. So this chicken actually doesn't even fill us up as well as those black raspberries. What a shame. What a shame. Do I have any more of those black raspberries left? I do not. I do not. Um, chicken only does one. A whole chicken. Really? Are you sure about that? Um, let's see. What else do we have that the wine berries are all right? But I don't want to eat all the wine berries because I have a feeling um, we could potentially make the wine with them and i really want to get into that as well there i do have some very light brewery type stuff on here for making you know 
some fun little adult beverages, but I think um, there, sh there should have been at least a few skeletons that spawned in the area last night. Let's go see if we can find them or at least just, you know, find their bones. Preferably, I would just, you know, just find their bones. Um, hey, Boney, where are you? I don't hear anything. I know I- Ow! Bees! For cereal? I literally thought it was a skeleton. Nope, just bees. Just bees, you guys. I'm do I don't see anything. I know I saw spiders out the window and everything. Like, there was one standing right there last night. Huh. Huh. Well, alright then. I'm a little disappointed. I really kind of wanted um, some, some more bone meal. But, you know, that's fine. That's fine. We are refueled. Our hunger is refueled back to the grindstone. Alrighty, we have ground up all of the hemp, you guys. We have enough, I think, to make one more um, little sail thingy. Yeah, so we can make only two with all that hemp. All of that hemp that we have had harvested. Um, I mean, literally a sack and a half, maybe a little more of hemp and... Um, all it makes is two sails. So it's gonna take us a really, really long time to uh, to get all the hemp that we need, but that is all right. We also have to make gear boxes, you guys. So um, we need, I think, either siding or slabs, I want to say. Please tell me you take slabs as well and not just siding, because if that's the case, I'm gonna be in trouble because I don't think you can make siding with, um, with a saw. Either way, let's try making these wooden gears, which is just wood planks and then four wooden planks, four sticks. And our inventory is getting cluttered real fast. Real fast. Um, okay, so I can't remember if I have a lot of sticks. I think I actually, all my tools to make my sticks are back at the house, so we're gonna have to go there and get that. And I have planks, so I think, yeah, definitely we need to go back to the house, make a few gears, and then we can uh, come back to the windmill and finish up making the gear boxes because, like a noob, I totally forgot to bring the gold and the redstone with me when I came over here. You know, typical. Typical. Okay. Um, and then what we do is we take this, I think, and we do something like this. Ow. Uh, that was me hitting my elbow. Um, and then, yeah, it makes sticks. And then I think we did like doop, 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 like that. Actually, I think we do, we do, we do four, I, I believe. Oh, we're gonna have to definitely make more sticks. Oh, and that makes two gears. So, yeah, we just have to make, uh, two more sticks. Two more. We're, there, there it is. Okay, our little knifey mabob, and uh, this, this like so, and boom, more, uh, more wooden gears. Okay, and then what we do is we take all the gears and we take the planks. Oh, it can take planks. So all we need is gold nuggets and excuse me, um, gold nuggets, and then one piece of redstone, which is very cheap recipe very cheap indeed let's go make our gearboxes and then we can go upstairs and place the gearbox because you know that's what we've all been waiting for um <laughs> i really need to make more progression on this windmill you guys i mean it's getting real sad real sad um so we need one little bit of gold and then one little piece of redstone pretty cheap and then we take the gold we do this we get the nuggets and then we do the nuggets and then we do the redstone and boom redstone the latch and then boom gearbox we are gonna have to make a whole bunch more of those gearboxes but for now that'll do that'll do and then we also have to do an axle like that there we go and we have an axle and then that is pretty much all we can make for for now um let's go up up to the top and place the uh, gearboxes. So this right here is the front and I think we are going to have to end up breaking this glass. Ooh dear, I forgot about that. Um, to place the, um, the gearbox. Ah, so sad, okay. Um, and then, uh, gear, okay. You know what? I'm not going to place this correctly and I don't want to have to break everything. So I'm just going to go into creative and place this because, you know, I, I like I said, I don't want to have to break my whole windmill to do this, you guys. I put a lot of work into this. Um, uh, there we go. 
Game mode C. Ha ha. Uh, there we go. We're gonna see it. Like, um, I'm gonna have to break all that to really get out here. And um, I don't even know how to necessarily place this the correct way. See, not even placing that the correct way, but the glass can go back there. Um, and then I think it, you, yeah, there you go. And then we're gonna place our one axle going out that way. And that is what the windmill is actually, uh, blah, 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 blah. Um, we're probably gonna need to make another axle and have it come all the way out this way because the windmill cannot be obstructed in like, a 13 by 13 block radius. It is big. It is real big. So uh, then we have to just, just to come in here, throw away, that's painful. Uh, throw that away, throw that away, throw that away. And I think that is everything, but we have got our, our lovely little gearbox installed here and I just have to go grow um, stacks on stacks on stacks on stacks on stacks more hemp but i think i'm actually going to leave you guys here for today i'm gonna get back to my hemp farming so that that way in the next episode we can finally finally put this windmill together and then once we put the windmill together we can then make all the fences and once we have all the fences then we can go back over there and we can put all the fences down and then we can let all the horses out then we can get cows we can get pets we can get all the things all the things but it all starts with this windmill so I'm gonna get grinding and I will see you guys in the next episode when we make that windmill. I promise next episode windmill will be made for sure 100% Sable's promise. So uh, as always you guys please remember to leave a like on this video if you like this video and also to encourage me in my hemp farming. Seriously you guys when I am hemp farming and um, actually that sounds that doesn't sound that bad really does it? Mm -mm. Um, <laughs> but when I am hemp farming in Minecraft um, it can get a little bit tedious. It can get a little bit a little bit painful um, just sitting here just watching other people's YouTube videos and then just like watching the weeds grow essentially. Ah, punny. See what I did there? <laughs> um, <laughs> sorry. All right, I'll let you guys go. Please remember to leave a like on this video because it does help me when I'm sitting here farming plants for hours and hours and hours and um, follow my channel. Yeah, if you haven't followed my channel yet, please follow my channel because I post videos almost every single day, except for Mondays. I don't post on Mondays because, you know, a girl needs a day of rest. So I'll see you guys in the next one. All right. Bye-bye.